Local music, food, and thousands of Alaskans in the forest means only one thing, the Girdwood Forest Fair, where everyone flocks to the woods for some summer fun. All year long you can go without seeing people and you come to the forest fair and you see all your, your friends and your extended family, it's great. It's a three-day celebration which focuses on Alaskan-made products. More than 150 vendors from around the community were in attendance, including nine-year-old Talia Halverson, who is selling caramel she made, a recipe she got from her grandmother. She thought it would be a big hit, so I wanted to make some money. Not only does the Girdwood Forest for highlight local foods and crafts, it's also a place where you'll find students and volunteers on a mission to recycle. Within the crowds and trees, you couldn't miss the cheers Yay! of a handful of recycling cheerleaders who returned for a second year to get people to think about where their trash goes. And we ended up cheering for people that did it right and then booing for the ones that did it wrong. And it just turned in this big thing and they cheered for us in the beer garden while we were cheering. It was a lot of fun. The teens are part of the Alaska Youth for Environmental Action Group, a teen leadership program that helps youth get involved with environmental issues through projects. You throw things away all the time so you don't really think about it, it's just an instinct. But you need to start thinking about which things you can recycle. I grew up recycling and it's just it's better for the environment, it saves our resources, it saves landfill space, it saves money, it's pretty much good all around. It's a cause the Girdwood Fair has been involved with for many years, but now they have some help to keep the cause alive. From the Girdwood Forest Fair, Alexis Fernandez, CBS 11 News.